A very pleasant morning to one and all. Here I am Anfal from Bharat Vidya Mandir to speak on the topic A Barrister to the Father of Nation. The period from 1920 to 1947 had been described as the Gandhian era in Indian politics. During the period, Gandhi spoke the final word on behalf of the Indian National Congress in negotiating with the British government for constitutional reforms and for talking out a program for the national movement. Mahatma Gandhi led the national freedom struggle against the British rule. The most unique thing was about the struggle, it was very completely non-violent. Mahatma Gandhi was born on 2nd October 1869 at Porbandar in Gujarat. After finishing his early education in India, he sailed to England in 1891 and qualified as barrister. The political career of Gandhi started in South Africa where he launched a civil disobedience movement against the maltreatment meted out to Asian settlers. The British passed the Rowlett Act in 1919 to deal with the revolutionaries. Gandhi made the Rowlett Act an issue and appealed to the people to observe peaceful demonstration on April 6, 1919. The Jalinwala massacre was a secure of this education. Gandhi then launched a non-cooperation movement in 1920 against the British rule. The British was asked to leave India forthwith. The moving spirit behind the resolution was Gandhiji. The Quit India movement was the greatest challenge to the British Empire. Gandhi was a great leader, a saint and a great social reformer. He was pious, truthful and religious. He believed in simple living and high thinking. Everybody who came in contact with him was so deeply influenced by his personality. He was a champion of democracy and was deadly opposed to dictatorial rule. Gandhi began to work day and night for the freedom of his country. He and his brave followers went to jail again and again and suffered terrible hardships. Thousands of them were starved, beaten, ill-treated and killed, but they remained true to their master. At last, his noble efforts bore fruit and on August 15, 1947, India became free and independent. Gandhi defeated the mighty British Empire not with such organs but by means of strange and utterly new, new weapons of truth and peace. Gandhi wrote his famous autobiography under the title My Experience with Truth. Gandhi always stood for communal harmony but he himself was shot dead by a religious fanatic Naduram Godse on 30th January 1948. The whole world mourned his death. Thank you for giving me this opportunity.